To download mods for Baldur's Gate 3, it's very simple. You're gonna first going to want to download a mod manager to make it nice and easy to see where all your mods are and to be able to turn them on and off. So you're going to want to type in Baldur's Gate 3 mod manager at the top and it bring you to GitHub. Once you're here, you're going to scroll down and hit grab the latest release. Once you do that, it's going to download it up here, hit done, open it, and you are going to want to extract all. Once you extract all, it should download the mod manager and open up. The mod manager will look something like this. Once you have the mod manager installed, now we need the mods. So the next step is to go to the Nexus mod store. And once you're on here, you're going to want to make sure it's on Baldur's Gate 3, which it should be already. Then you're going to go to most popular all time. The first three right here. So we're going to start with the improved UI, and this is how you download them. Go to files, and then so right here, improved UI, and you also need the assets for this one. So you're going to hit manual download. Once you download them, hit slow download. It should take a second to download. Once you actually have the file though, they're really easy to uh, put into the mod manager. So all you're going to do is go back to the mod manager, hit import mod, and then you would hit improved UI. I already have it, but then so basically, so like the five E spell ones, the next one, all you do once you have them is drag them over here to then equip them. So now they're on. Down here, the improved UI, once you have it, you're going to need to right click on it and hit allow in load order. Once you have these over here, you should be fine. And we will go on to the next step of adding the party be gone. For the party be gone mod, make sure you're on the popular all time page and it should be over here on the right. You're going to then click files if it's on description and at the time of this video it is on version 1.7.3 hit download once you have the file downloaded you're going to want to extract all and once you have the mods they should be right here all you're going to do is drag them in the data folder of the game so to open that you can go to Steam, hit browse local files, open the data folder, and as you can see they're already in here for me because I have the mods, but you, all you're going to do is drag them over here, and that's how you have the initial mods. This is for the single player to have up to 16 players. I will next show you how to add it so you can play with um, up to 8 friends for multiple. The last and final step for Party Be Gone multiplayer to work with up to 8 friends is pretty simple. So you're going to open the local file for the game, open bin, then up here hit the plus. You're going to want to go to your modded folder that had the 1.7 download in it. So for me, I rename 9 to mods and then right here 1.7. You're going to drag the game over here. It's going to uh, open it. It's going to do some little gibberish on your screen. Don't worry about that. It's basically making a backup of the file and stuff for you later to use on or to delete if you want to revert back to an old save. Once you have this, you're done. You can add up to 8 friends or play with up to 16 um, NPCs in your single player uh, run. Once you have the mod installed, you're going to want to load up the game and you can check in the game to see if they're installed besides also checking to see if the backup folder is in there. Once on the game, one simple way to check if your mods work is to go to multiplayer, create a game, and on the right side where it chooses your party size limit, you'll see in a sec, it should allow me to change it to 8. You can have up to 8 friends playing multiplayer with you. Some small issues with these mods are, you may need to uh, disband or send away a companion to then be able to recruit more than 4, but it should work after that. If this video helped you in any way, shape, or form, please drop a like and subscribe.